Boeing successfully performed a launch pad abort test of the company's Starliner crew capsule on November 4th, 2019. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. On ignition, the capsule's four launch abort engines fired for 5.1 seconds, producing 18,000 kilograms of force pulling the capsule away from the launch platform. Nearing its apogee, the capsule performed a pitch around maneuver to reorientate itself for the final stages of the abort. Over the next few seconds, the Starliner capsules, drogue, pilots and then main parachutes were deployed. During this phase, one of the capsule's pilot parachutes sheared off early, ensuring its main parachute could not be deployed. However, due to redundancy in the systems, the two remaining parachutes were sufficient for a safe touchdown. Soon after the main chute deployment, the service module and heat shield were jettisoned and the capsule's airbags inflated. The airbags ensure the capsule remains afloat following an ocean splashdown when returning home from space. Today, however, the airbags provided a little bounce as the capsule touched down safely on the desert floor. Despite the failure of one of the Starliner capsule's parachutes, NASA confirmed that the test had been completely successful. Quote, although designed with three parachutes, two opening successfully is acceptable for the test parameters and crew safety. End quote. With the successful completion of the pad abort test, Boeing can move forward with the main orbital test flight of Starliner. The flight is expected to be launched aboard an Atlas V on a mission to the International Space Station on December 17th.